Okay, guys, I'm still tuning this nice uh, Sony 222 SL. I'm already tuning playback levels and frequency response. It performs really, really well now. And now I tune it up uh, bias in the middle position for the Type 1 tape. And it does recording now. Uh, here is the frequency sweep. So check yourself. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 kilohertz. Well, pretty good for Sony. Yeah? A little bit like one and a half decibel inconsistency in middle range between left and right channel but it's uh, maximum i can get from this deck uh, let's check uh, the calibrator how it tune it up yeah and it's perfect it says bias a little bit off and i probably would would keep it i will adjust the levels of the generator let me check which one of this bunch goes key low calibrator high another low and high those two generators and i believe we need to adjust the level for the indicator like that done a very minor, minor adjustment, just a little bit. <laughs> Still blinking. Okay, let me straighten up. Okay. Now I return level back, and it will be ideal. Good. You see, Evan Calibrator keeps consistent over all those years. And we're still receiving the same frequency response. Wow, good. So now I will adjust for the chrome and metal tapes. And this deck will be done, complete. It sounds really, really well now. I check it up a couple of tapes and bass is consistent like uh, it's much better it's on pair of the 890 golden which i did and it sound really well so the only changes i replaced this double 22 microfarad here and here with 10 microfarad by 50 volts everything else is the same values as it was before so those are 4.7 this is on Dolby 1 microfarad, guys. This is, I uh, believe, 10 microfarads, and this, and this is 22. And here we have, tw oh, it's 10, it's 100, it's 1 microfarad, and it's 10. That's it. Sound is really, really cool. I will do a demo for you. See you soon. Bye-bye.